Welcome to Nibbling with the Neighbors. Come on in and have a bite. Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Nibbling with the Neighbors. I'm back! I'm still actually only one-handed. I don't have my sling on only because it attracts a lot of cat hair and stuff and it's not too uh, sanitary to be in the kitchen cooking with it. So I took it off um, while I do this. Kevin's going to assist me when needed. I am making tilapia with garbanzo beans and asparagus. And I'm going to make the asparagus a little bit differently than what I've been making it. So. First, we're going to defrost the tilapia, which I already have done, and it's in the frying pan or the baking pan right here. I'm going to preheat the oven uh, to 350. And what I'm going to do, I'm trying something a little new with the tilapia. I have an olive oil and balsamic organic vinaigrette dressing. So instead of cooking it with olive oil I'm gonna use this and I'm gonna pour a generous amount over each piece and then I am going to make sure each piece is covered just by moving it around in the sauce like I'm doing here and then I'm going to add some of my spices to it. A little bit of onion powder, a little bit of garlic pepper, because we all love garlic in this house, a little bit of basil, a little bit of our favorite newest seasoning, tarragon. Okay, so that's all ready to go into the oven, but I have to wait till my oven hits temperature, so I'm going to go ahead and set that off to the side over here. Normally, as many of you have seen, I would do my asparagus in the oven on a baking sheet going to do it slightly different this time to give you guys some other ideas on how to do it. So, we're still going to kind of prepare it the same way. First thing we're going to do is cut off the, the stems and then we're going to put it all in this bag. So, I'll prepare that and I'll be right back. Okay, so I cut off all the stems to my asparagus and put them in the bag. And just as normal, I'm going to add some olive oil into the bag. Okay, and I'm going to cut up some whole garlic. And again, I don't know if you all remember, but the Presleys taught me this, meet the Presleys. Um, Josh, who is a chef, um, taught me this. When you want to peel your garlic, you put it into a Tupperware bowl and you shake okay, it. Okay, my oven has hit temperature, so I'm going to have Kevin put the pan in the oven for me so I don't have to lift it. Watch your legs. And I'm finishing up right now on chopping up the garlic that I'm going to add to the asparagus. Smell like a, a good way to keep vampires out of here for today, babe? Yep, and me. And you! Okay, so we put some garlic in there. And then I'm going to add probably just a little bit of tarragon in there. Whoops, I stepped on a piece of asparagus on the floor. Okay, and I'm going to add a little bit of 
olive oil to my pan here on the stove. So again, close your bag and you mix it all up. Well, the fish cooked quicker than I thought it would, so it's been in the oven for about a half hour now on 350. So Kevin's going to open up my garbanzo beans and put them in the blue bowl. And we're going to get those in the microwave. I got my oil heating up on the stove here for my mixture of my asparagus. This won't take too long on the stove. So I just want to make sure it heats up a little bit. My helper. So helpful. You put those in for about seven minutes. Seven minutes on the garbanzo beans. So this is just another way of cooking asparagus instead of putting it in the oven. I'm going to add a little bit of sweet paprika to the asparagus, just to spice it up a little bit. Oh, hey, so dinner is ready. We have our garbanzo beans here. Just came out of the microwave. We have our beautiful fish here, tilapia. Looks yummy, smells yummy. And we have our asparagus that we cooked in on top of the stove this time. What you see here, that's that's the garlic that all cooked up. And you can cook this as long as you'd like. If you like it crunchier, you can leave it, not cook it as long. If you like it really soft, you can cook it longer. Right now it's at a happy medium. So we're going to go ahead and dish it out and then we'll show you, give you our taste test. Okay, so Kevin is going to dig in first. Tilapia. Good. Can you taste the dressing? Mm -hmm. Does it taste good? Mm -hmm. Okay. The asparagus. Pretty good. Can you taste the cayenne? Or the sweet paprika. It was paprika. A little. Is it too undercooked, overcooked? No, it's good. Okay. All right. My turn. Hey, nice. Kevin about thumbs up. We'll have to do that afterwards. Mmm. I like the fish a lot. That dressing really, really made it taste good. Garbanzo beans. Hmm. Never had those before. <laughs> Only kidding. And the asparagus. Okay. That's what I give it. There's one. One? And there's the other. Okay. <sighs> so, there you have it, guys. Another episode of Nibbling with the Neighbors. Tilapia fish with asparagus. We will catch you 